What's up? I'm making this video to show the difference in the routing capabilities of the Wren and machine. Um, Got to give shout, shout outs to uh, DJ Hellfire and MPC from the MPC forum because um, they inspired me to go ahead and make this video. Um, I just want to show where each of them excel in, in their routing. Uh, cause we had a little discussion on the forum. Okay. First of all, I just want to point out the Wren. It ha it excels in parallel routing and machine excels in series routing. And I'll, I'll explain. <coughs> okay. Let me go to the Wren first. And, um, I made this little four on the floor, uh, pattern. I put it one uh, kick drum, you know, MIDI note on each track. I used eight tracks to make uh, two bars. It's the same kick drum from the from the same program, that kick drum there. But uh, as I cycle through the tracks, you see what I'm saying? I just, you know, got eight tracks. And I did this to show the parallel routing capabilities of the Wren. I'll play this little four on the floor, two measure, two bar loop. Okay. Now I'm gonna go to the the track mixer. Now this is where the Wren excels as far as this routing capabilities. Now I'm using the same exact sample from the same exact program, but I have that same sample recorded on eight different tracks. I have eight different uh, effects or seven different effects and one without an effect on these eight different tracks. And I'll play it and you just see the different sounds of the same sample. So I'll go ahead and play it. So that gives you some interesting uh, possibilities. Say for example, you have a pad sound, a, you know, one program, a pad sound, but you want to you want to make that <clears throat> excuse me that pad sound full in the mix. You know, you want it to be over five different tracks and spread it out throughout the stereo uh, panoramic field. You know, so that parallel routing is great for that. I'll show machine and how it excels i also made <clears throat> excuse me a little you know four and floor uh one measure pattern now i'll go ahead and play it first okay now with with machine it has uh the series routing which is which is great uh for what it for what it does like I said, they both have, you know, uh, potential in different ways, the Wren and the machine. So if I route this kick drum to, I've already set up on group B. So uh, I route it to input one, which I have an effect on. I have guitar rig with some stuff on there. So I go ahead and play that four on the floor. Okay, great. So I route that out to this next input, which is input two on the same group, which I, you know, before I start the video, I set it up. So now on this, I have a delay. I play that four on the floor again. Okay, cool. And I can keep on going. Okay, I'll put a, uh, let me go back route that out to the third input which I have a reverb on so I hit again so like I said they both have their own benefits and 
their own limitations. So uh, just wanted to point that out. And I hope that helps, you know, you, you guys to make, you know, some, some better sounds or, or better ideas or whatnot. All right, thanks a lot.